Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. I'm Renee. Um, a lot of people have asked me, <clears throat> what do you do with the end pieces from the deli meats that, you know, you can buy them. Apparently this person could have bought a big bag of end pieces and, you know, ends and pieces from, from the lunch meats in the deli section and they could have got it very cheap, but she passed on it because she wasn't sure what to do with this. So this is so easy and don't pass on it because I make a delicious uh, lunch spread with it. Sandwich spread like a bologna spread, only it's with a lot of hams and, and um, turkey and chicken and all, all different. And I just mix it all together. It's, it's delicious. So that's what I'm going to show you how to do today. And as soon as I get these all ground up, plus I'm going to grind up an onion with it, as soon as I get them all ground up, I'll bring you back and I'll show you how to put this sandwich spread together. So we got this all ground up and I've got turkey, I've got chicken, I've got ham and that's just those three different and, and some's roasted. I think the one was a fried chicken um, lunch meat. It's it's really good. But anyway, I got this all mixed up and I, or uh, all ground up and I got my onion ground up in there. So now it's just a matter of we're going to mix this up and then we're going to add our goodies into here. Yummy. Okay, so I'm going to first, I'm going to grind, grind some pepper in here because I want pepper in it. My whole family loves pepper. I don't need any salt unless you like a lot of salt. That I mean, the meat is real, you know, it's loaded with sodium. So I'm going to get, let's see, a nice big spoonful of sweet relish. I'm going to do a couple of them, just like so. I just do it to taste. I'm also going to put just a little bit of garlic in here. Maybe like a teaspoon of minced garlic. Garlic goes good in everything. And then we're going to do the mayo. We'll start with that. We'll start mixing this all up. Just mix it. I never measure anything. I just go by how it tastes or looks. That looks pretty good. Now I'm going to give it a little taste to make sure I've got enough of the sweet relish in there. And that's delicious. There's a little more relish there. I like lots of sweet relish in it. And this is a perfect way to use up the ends and pieces, especially if you get them on a, on a, you know, on a cheap price. A lot of stores, though, they do this with their ends and pieces, and then they sell it for, you know, three dollars and fifty cents a pound. You can get it for a buck fifty or a buck or even cheaper per pound and make your own. And you can add anything you want in here. You can add peppers and anything you want, really. Size the limit. Let's taste this and see if I got enough in there. Yep. That, friends, 
is perfect. If you take a look at that, that looks wonderful. So that's what you can do instead of passing up that bag of end in pieces, ends in pieces, you can make a nice sandwich spread out of it. So there you have it, friends. Thanks for watching.